Welcome back to the Lost in Thought Podcast. I'm your host, Nate Tippery. To the right of me is Brian Lawyer, the community manager. In front of me, Jeffrey Mayfield, the audio and technical engineer. Um, today we have Mad Take, of course, everyone's favorite. Oh, my yeah, personal. Take, mad what, take. what does Mad Take mean, Nate? It means uh, it's a take that <laughs> What's is a Mad Take. Well, you know, so there's uh, this controversial uh, verdict that happened today. Uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> not today. I guess it would have been <laughs> this weekend. Over uh, okay. Um, and so uh, Mad Take. Yeah, we'll be doing that. <laughs> that <laughs> was a Mad Take. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's uh, a spin off pretty... of Mad Lib. For those of you who have not watched our previous <laughs> episode, it was a Mad Lib. Except the website is called Mad, mad Takes, take. so. probably because it got copyrighted. Like probably. our YouTube video. <laughs> oh. uh, no, so yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll be discussing some YouTube shenanigans. YouTube being youtube so us using their platform you know we've heard rumors about how bad yeah um copyright strikes to can be, be fair though at least it's not twitch that's yeah i guess that's, that's true true could be worse so, it does add up so yeah we've got the brunt of of you of youtube's uh shenanigans mm-hmm. as we have so well only put on our itinerary that has shrunk and shrunk shenanigans not, exa- not not existing hey, this one's bigger than last week it is bigger than last week's that's for oh. sure so youtube shenanigans <laughs> yeah, and because of that we're going to be uh the, i hope you guys enjoyed our intro music that uh, we so elegantly put together and thought of about at at Fazoli's, you know, as as Sunday tradition. Where all the best ideas come from. People tried to stand in our way, small companies, large companies, (laughs) and they couldn't stop us. (laughs) So, yeah, we put... We put it in our own hands now. We overcame two corporations. <laughs> That's right. We, we beat YouTube. <laughs> we beat YouTube. <laughs> Take that. Until we post it and we get copyrighted a third time. <laughs> I guess then the joke will be on us, but we will we will persist. <laughs> That's for sure. We'll do whatever it takes to get this intro to you guys. <laughs> I will do what I must. All right. <laughs> So put it into like eight bit audio. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> It'll sound phenomenal. <laughs> yeah, it'll be perfect. Just okay. some, some animal. But anyways. Mad tag. So, so we also have Kenobi coming up. We'll be discussing that. So kind of a spoiler warning I now. If you have I not watched it, again. Uh, um, then I would suggest clicking off because we will be revealing. Well, clicking off after our mad tag. Well, after, well, clicking off during the well, Kenobi section. we got a little bit until we get to the Kenobi section. We'll warn you yes, again we'll before we'll the Kenobi section. I'm just saying, I, I'm just, yeah, I'm just saying as... Specifically for that, if you we, we want to discuss anything right now, but when we get there, there will be some spoilers just for heads up. Please don't leave now. We need the watch time, yeah, for real. <laughs> yeah, please, please don't carry our watch time, <laughs> we need build it, it up. <laughs> so, we need f- you. <laughs> 4,000 watch time hours is so we can become a partner. What That's a at? lot of hours. What are we at? Like 200. You said 300 you, the I, other day, you know what? Uh, what 300? I couldn't remember. You know, 300, I'm not even mad about that. <laughs> No, it's pretty good. Uh, I, uh, I think yeah. it was like two ninety. So, so everything that we've done so far, we just had to do ten more times. <laughs> exactly, it's, it's easy. Not that bad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's all right it's, it's good yeah. we enjoy doing it so it's not gonna be that big of a deal so but yeah so we have an update uh for the uh, uh our broadcast for otter things <laughs> yeah we'll oh, yeah. get into more detail um when that time comes also, some more Overwatch 2 news, and then, you know, <laughs> I almost just read off the itinerary verbatim and just said Big Axe, and I, you know what, I'm going to. Then we'll have discussion about a Big Axe. All right, Matt, take, Jeff. <laughs> All right. So today, we have our declaration of... Dot, 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 dot. Of ad lib. Um, you want me to start us off? i Or in one second. So we don't know what the declaration is yet. We don't know which one of these boxes are going to be. Yeah, the one which that one is the. <laughs> so, so we'll, we'll get there. So, yes, Nate, let's go ahead and start with the noun plural. Remember, this is contributed by Tina. Thank you, Tina. Hey, guys, uh, what's Tina. an adjective? <laughs> Dang. Brian, I don't know. That's a good question. Could you, uh, 
enlighten the viewers of what an adjective is. Wait, hold on. <laughs> Would an adjective technically be a noun because it's a person, place, or thing? Like, an adjective is a thing. Adjective what? is not a thing. I mean, the adjective itself right, right, being, yeah. a, being a thing. I see where you're going with this. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> so is it... So it, 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 guys, exists. I'm going to forget what an adjective is. <laughs> so it existing, is it technically then a noun? No. I guess it would be a proper noun, right? An adjective of itself would be... Or it's an aspect of grammar. So... I guess <laughs> technically it would be a noun, right? There's it, yeah, some right, English teacher saying. out there. I don't know. Any, any English There's English some English, out te- uh, English teacher out there right now that is very mad at us. <laughs> for being right and finally enlightening the people <laughs> with the truth? <laughs> You've been lying <laughs> to them for years. years. <laughs> also, uh, hold up. I want announcement real quick. In case you were watching the last episode and you saw a quick frenzy over a massive ant, and you heard us shouting oh, and yeah. picking the mics of ending the war. Uh, we won the war. There have been no ants in this house since oh we killed goodness. that queen ant. We're pretty it. sure that was the queen ant. Even if it I wasn't, it, was massive. it might have just been yeah. that the uh, treatment finally worked, but that took a long time if yeah. it did. Like, we're talking months. I mean, that ant was at least as big as my foot. At, at least. <laughs> I don't think that's <laughs> true. <least>. But, <laughs> but it was a lot bigger than a normal ant. Yeah. Yeah. The size of Jeff's foot. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we said, Brian. But we got we got no more ants in here. <laughs> Go get your English textbook. <laughs> True. Shut up, Brian. For I real. Need Retake. Uh, I don't know. Kindergarten. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go ask your grandma how to form a sentence. <laughs> For real. How do I, an what's an adjective? Is now, Brian. <laughs> an adjective is a noun. No, no. I'm gonna get confused. Oh. All uh, right. So anyway, Nate, let's this is kick, how I lose. <laughs> kick this off. <laughs> Adjectives. <laughs> uh, uh, plural. <laughs> oh, okay. yeah. oh no! We did it. But yeah, that that leads me to. But now this is this has got this. I'm racking my brain now. Okay, so like, <laughs> like Just aspects purple of English. Before I forget like, what an adjective an, is. Like, <laughs> okay, Nate. But like the entity of themselves. Okay, like. Or would it be the textbooks containing the knowledge of said thing, right? You know, like right. You know, like I, a history I, textbook would be a noun, but is the history itself right. contained within? Ooh, I don't know. I have to think about that for a second. You know what oh I mean? Oh my goodness! I, I, yeah, I see it more as just it just it existing as a concept. That's what would, I'm saying. Would, right, would make, would make it, it a thing. thing. Right, would make it a thing, a which thi- falls into the category of a, a noun. noun. That's what I'm saying. But history yes. being. I, the context of the overarching, you know, somebody's going to drop some the knowledge in the <laughs> comments later, and they're going to freaking tell us that we're either very right or very wrong. It I could go like either way. Right. <laughs> like, like seriously, we or have... there's another grammatical term that just describes that perfectly. Somebody Google this, Eric. Get a oh on the head. no! <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, <laughs> Eric's not here. Of course. Um, Rest in peace, Derek. Well, I wonder what his excuse is this time. I heard he broke up with Janessa. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> he's gonna, he doesn't watch this. No, I, I, mean, I was going to say he's going to watch this and be very confused for a solid <laughs> two to three seconds. Just gets a text from Janessa. Like, what? what? Are you, wait, Janessa watches this? She she better. That's all I have to say. All right, Madeline. Where were we at? Purple? Um, yeah, yeah, I used so that I before I forgot an, what an adjective an was. Adjective. Um, let's see. Excruciating. Oh, sorry. So, yeah, my, uh, you I was just kind of like, you know. <laughs> I was like, whose okay. turn is it? It's my turn. I was ending in ED. Um, fanning. <laughs> what? Fanning, like you're fanning something. No, ED has e- to end in ED. Oh, I, th- I thought I said I, I did this last <laughs> week. I was looking at the wrong one. There's another one coming up. Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm, I'm not here. Fan. Uh, <laughs> fan. Oops. Do I have another Brian adjective? <laughs> what? I don't want to use the same one I used last week, which was what I thought of. I was going to say quickly again, and I'm like, I just used that last <laughs> Brian, time. come on, man. Everybody um, look at the idiot. 
my brain doesn't work this fast. I was sitting here thinking of a noun because I was one off. Keep had, stalling, Brian. Go ahead. Come on. No, I got something in here somewhere. <laughs> Just um, find, it's just a SpongeBob running around. <laughs> it's just like all this brain. Everything's, everything's on, on fire. fire. He's going yeah, through yeah. the filing Speaking cabinets. Speaking of fire, is like charred an adjective? Like the w- charred log. log. Yes. Yeah. yeah. No, yeah. charred is 100%. It describes. Because I was also thinking my <laughs> like brain Anakin's was on fire. Anakin's face was charred after Obi Wan left him for dead. True. <laughs> hey, I have to watch that movie. <laughs> no, spoilers for a movie that came out in 2005, by the way. So. <laughs> <laughs> a noun um Jedi <laughs> did we do that last yes. let's do a different noun a different noun yeah. we already used Jedi we used Jedi before okay Sith <laughs> yeah. I, I was I was thinking about it um youngling <laughs> there we go oh, there we go verbnate contemplate contemplate Speaking of, I hope we have enough plates tonight. No, we don't. We don't have any we plates, have but we do have a bunch of bowls. <laughs> um, plural noun? Yes. Otters. <laughs> we have some beef with some yeah. otters. Verb ending in ing. Oh, back, <laughs> back to me with the ing. Um, no, it's no me. Way oh, it's you. That's right. I, I'm not with it today, people. Sucking. Okay. Adjective. Oh man, I'm gonna sit here and stall for about yeah, you fifty should. minutes. You don't know what an adjective is. I don't know is. what an adjective is. Okay, Google, give me an adjective. <laughs> that was work. loud enough. <laughs> okay. Um let's go with Oh no, I'm not gonna use the <laughs> I was gonna use... I finally caught myself, okay, people. Okay. I was gonna use the first thing that popped in my head. Oh no. That was not the call. <laughs> was it a slur? No. <laughs> it was not Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> let's go with uh, um, I was going to say Thank rustling goodness. that's not a word though is R- it rustling Rus- rustling but I'm like I was thinking like oh rustling <laughs> that's not a word I was thinking of like your hair is all um, raggedy but rustly was the first thing mm. well do you so, want to use raggedy yeah, yeah I want to use raggedy but I was thinking rustling I don't know why that's not a word but or it could be Noun rustling Brian. through the left shoe left all right, and now for me, hmm, thinky, easy. <laughs> Nate, <laughs> Adjective. Adjective. you said pinky, and the first thing was fetish. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> but the, I don't think that's a. I guess you can describe that. Wouldn't be an adjective <laughs> like this. I don't <laughs> think that would be. technically. It would technically wouldn't work. No. So, but I'll go. I'll go with um, p- plastic. Plastic, Brian. You have a noun, and you got to make this one. <laughs> so, good. Okay, and this is this is brings up another point. So, like, plastic is a thing, but yeah. you can describe something being plastic, right? So, like the water bottle, the plastic, plastic water, water bottle, bottle. Yeah. right? Yeah. Plastic's then. And an the reason adjective. why I brought that up because I, I was thinking, I'm like, you could. There's a lot of so words. So does that then again make that adjective, adjective a noun? noun? Exactly. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> uh, queen ant. Queen ant. Oh no, that's going to be the ruler in the declaration. <laughs> By what? decree of the queen ant. Wait, no. A N T, not A U N T. Verb. You didn't specify, Brian. Squish. Squish. <laughs> Another verb. Another Nate verb ended. Nate. Um, resurrect. <laughs> <laughs> it's coming back. The queen ant is coming back. All right. Let's go mad. The deck relate deck. Oh my goodness. Declaration of. Uh, we hold these adjectives to be self purple. That all men are created excruciating, <laughs> that they are fanned by their creator for certain charred rights, that among these are youngling, liberty, and the contemplate of happiness, <laughs> that to secure these rights, honors are instituted among <laughs> sucking the raggedy pout. Oh, no. No, no. Where'd our TV go? No, no, no. Oh, oh we can't read the it. end. Back to the rescue dog end? show. How does it end? 
That is, is it going to play the rescue dog show? <laughs> the time, the, the new America Please has come been back. thwarted. Please come back. Is it back? Oh no. Is it, what is have it you back? Done? Did Jeff, I is it back? Anything. Jeff, oh my goodness. It's because the TV's not close enough to the Wi Fi. Is it back? We'll just bring the Wi-Fi closer for him. You just pick up the Wi-Fi <laughs> and move it over there. It's true. Just push it over there. Oh, no. Just take Bikini Bottom and push it over there. Why isn't it working? I wonder if they lost. ruined our mad take. This is ridiculous. We gotta start over. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Oh. No, uh, that's not anything. Give it a second. On my, I'm on the Mac. It says it's connected. Come it on. It doesn't look very connected. Come on. This is this is horrible. We this have is ruined the worst it. thing yeah. ever. Now we're never gonna be able to do a mad oh, no. take again. We ruined it. What a stupid idea by Tom. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, that's TV Plus. No. Oh, it's Lucky, Lucky Dog. Dog. Lucky Dog Lucky is back. Dog. Lucky so, Dog. Wow. Wait, wow. Flash. Oh, hold up, hold up, we hold up, hold up. Oh, okay, never mind. I was going to tell a story, but here we go. Jeff, we don't want to read your text moment. messages. Let's just read your... Let's go. <laughs> it's back. All right. Suck Start it over. over. Oh, okay. Reagan powers from the consent of the left shoe. <laughs> 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 Whenever any form of pinky becomes plastic of the, uh, these ends, it is the queen ant of the people to squish <laughs> or to <laughs> resurrect <laughs> it. <laughs> that was so poetic. Oh. Uh, you know, it's... And see, that's the thing. This one isn't even that funny because... It's just, it's real. It's really it's real. It's not, it's not that funny. It's just yeah. the rights of the people. People fought for, for this. this. <laughs> yeah, for real. Thank Actually. you for your service. Thank yes. you for your service. The queen ant made sacrifices for yeah. us all. Thank long, you. Long live the queen. <laughs> long live the queen. Oh, man. That was pretty good. Right. Sucking <laughs> the raggedy powers. <laughs> the raggedy. <laughs> oh. Okay. From the consent of so the I'm left So I'm so glad shoe. that we flexed our grammatical skills once again to show everyone that we're Get intelligent. On. We all have degrees. Yeah. Uh, well, that's not true. <laughs> Jeff doesn't. I guess that's true. Yeah. Wow, what a loser. That's a degree in progress. To. Imagine not having a degree. <laughs> Technically, <laughs> I would have a gr degree right now if I hadn't left. <laughs> oh, yeah, switch. Colleges? Yeah. He, no, he just left. You just left. No further yeah, context. Just left. So, Jeff, the f stupid uh, Premiere Pro logo keeps popping up on the bottom. Why does that matter? Because it's annoying. Ryan, could Where? you be, no, be, I be also any just, more petty? I just wanted to make sure that you weren't opening up like Premiere Pro editing. It's like on your bar at the bottom. It keeps popping up. Oh. Okay, cool. Dang it. I mean, oh, no. That way, that way everybody can hear it. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to make it. Jeff wasn't like actively, accidentally editing a podcast in the background, oh, and sorry. it was going to mess Maybe up with I, our audio <laughs> recording. Maybe I should be, since I only have two day turnaround. <laughs> well, I want three day turnaround. <laughs> oh my goodness! All right, see you guys Thursday. <laughs> yeah, no. Thursday, ten a.m. Be there. <laughs> no Wednesday. Whatever. Oh, gosh, Brian, Ridiculous. why to be like this? We all agreed on Wednesday. It used to be Monday. Be thankful. Oh, I goodness. hated that. All right, so uh, <laughs> moving on. So I guess Brian and Jeff, you guys have a little bit more insight on the U YouTube, YouTube shenanigan shenaniganery. Yeah. Shenaniganery. Yes. So, so let's go ahead and lay it flat. <laughs> so basically, hey, that's my um, Wi-Fi password. Oh no! Just, Everyone, free Wi-Fi. Come to Brian. Free Wi-Fi. <laughs> Basically, just like um, in normal life, whenever we have to go buy something, uh, me and Brian kind of shop the goodwill of YouTube yeah. <laughs> um, for music, and this has not been working out. No, um, because not at people all. are lying, <laughs> <laughs> um, in, including them saying that they own something. And then and it's I, a free download. Yeah, it's a free download, and I don't think they actually <laughs> own it. Including, there was one that said, 
Marvel theme remix, and it was just the opening <laughs> theme. <laughs> to the yeah, it yeah, was the it same was thing. The exact same. And then they said free download. You can use it for whatever you Definitely want. Definitely not sketch. Yeah. yeah. So um that's Straight. unfortunate. But we're gonna make our own intro music. So wait, what was that? Let me I don't know. What was it? Was that your phone? <laughs> no. Somebody's phone just went off. Was it croaky? Was it croaky? Croaky, are you okay? You okay? He's okay. Okay. So let me get this straight. So you went to two different websites, correct? Yeah. So two different, different, different songs. The first, the they first, were both posted on YouTube. Yeah. The first one in the title said royalty free, but you had to pay for it in the description. I didn't look at that first one. That one's on me. Second one says the same thing, but in the description, it says, if you want to support me, you could go here, right? Yeah, yeah. And then under it says, free download, monetize as you wish, no copyright anything. Yeah. And then we also get flagged. Yeah. <laughs> but it's by the same... Yes, they were, but they, they're claiming well, both of those songs. But neither one of those were on the company's YouTube. Exactly. Yeah. But so they were both claimed it, by the same company. Like, stole it from them. Yeah, so I'm assuming they probably both stole it from... Yeah. Yes. Okay. So That's what I was wondering, like, oh, hey, we got these from two different sources, and but these are not actually your songs and you're copyright claiming them, but I'm assuming it's probably... But yeah, they, both got, they both got probably. claimed in the automatic scan, like YouTube yeah, does, like, a checks. quick scan, like yeah. a check. Yep. <laughs> And they both got claimed out of the automatic check system. Ironically, yeah. the clip of George Lucas in credits did not. Hey, it was but five it is, seconds. Yeah, as I say, it's five seconds or less, so usually that doesn't matter. That's how you can do like sound effects and stuff. So long story short, always believe everything you read on the internet. It's definitely always right <laughs> always and right. never always lies straight. to you. <laughs> so if we just have a five second intro, outro... <laughs> That's dun, right. Dun. We can use whatever we want. Oh. We use the part where it like breaks down at the end of the um, yeah. Marvel. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> that, would, that would be close. Bum, 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 bum. That Almost. might be. Yeah, if I would have done that straight, that was pretty close. I was looking at the. Just do the entrance to Duel of the Fates. Bum, bum. <laughs> bum, 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 What's up, guys? <laughs> <laughs> For episode four. <laughs> just me and Brian in the background just playing with lights. <laughs> now, <laughs> now uh, this is starting to become a good idea. <laughs> this, this is how it must be done. Be the choir. Oh my goodness, you're right. Yeah. This could work. This All will right. be the launch of our barbershop quartet. Quart I'm Which ready we for needed it. to get off the ground anyway. Yeah. We've been so. For those of the, you don't that don't know, we've been talking about that for a while too. <laughs> <laughs> Going to drop no. a mixtape sometime because we are all horrible. Well, I don't know. I've never really heard Jeff sing, but Jeff can sing because he had to learn how to sing for school. Yeah, I I've had to go through all kinds of skills training and stuff. But most of us are horrible singers. Yeah. <laughs> but that would just make it all the more entertaining, in my opinion. So. Yeah, barbershop quartet. We have a lot. Well, we have we have a lot to do. <laughs> we have we yeah, really we do, dug ourselves a hole a little bit too deep for all of this. <laughs> but we still have to become the next vlogging sensations of YouTube. Yeah. Gosh dang it, Brian. <laughs> what if I don't want to vlog? We're gonna you... vlog better than the Tamilios could ever dream me. of vlogging. You can't make me vlog, Brian. I'm not conforming to these social <laughs> YouTube norms. Well, my mom gonna... said that. <laughs> She could take us home if your mom could bring uh, you here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because gas prices are a little too high right now, and uh, uh, my dad says that we can't be driving back and forth all the time. So we got to split the split the responsibility. So if you could, but she uh, can take us home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She can take us <laughs> home. But I don't have time for this show. <laughs> or the money. Or the money. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so. No. So no vlog, but barbershop quartet. <laughs> vlog is coming too, <laughs> and it's going to be more of a barbershop. We will force the vlog <laughs> because that's ridiculous. Yeah, it'll end up being barbershop the three of us because Eric won't show up, so we'll be short a piece. That's pretty, but... that's pretty normal. So, so and yeah. somebody forgot Ashton. Yeah, yeah that Ryan. one was on me. What the heck? Ridiculous. I was going to bring Ashton this week for the podcast. Unreal. Oh, that could be our next <laughs> Ashton. That's true. That'll yeah. be awesome. We can have him here. For anyone that doesn't know, Ashton is my little brother. 
Guys, I have a great idea. We can vlog with Ashton during the 4th of July weekend. Oh my, he won't be yeah, there. Yeah, he's what? on vacation. He's yeah. on vacation. No Otherwise, shot. it would have been yeah. a great idea. Oh, no. Also, that means Ashton, who I just said could be our next guest it next week, be won't be here week. next week. It'd be the week after that. Unreal, dude. Empty promises, Brian. Come on, man. Yeah, it's all right. That's a level of a promise. That says how high is like Shaq promise. That's still happening. I'm, it'll happen one of these days. Yeah, <laughs> eventually. One day, one day we'll have Shaq on here. I'm sure there's an email. The phone, we'll send him an repre- email Someone to his Shaq. representation. Someone share our podcast. <laughs> Maybe text. they'll answer us. True. Yeah. Honestly. We, at least then we might get an automated reply. Yeah. <laughs> yeah for real. Something. Looking at you, otters. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Speaking of otters, uh, Kenobi. Wait. We'll get the otters later. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, guys, happy Father's Day. <laughs> oh, no. Happy Father's Day to all those fathers out there. It's not that week anymore. Every day is Father's Day, You're right. We should always appreciate our Unless fathers. Unless it's Mother's Day. Thank Unless, you for your service. Except for Mother's Day. Every, <laughs> but every other day is Father's Day. <laughs> <laughs> but um, Kenobi. All right, guys. Kenobi is finally over. Yeah. I thought it was a pretty, a, a pretty phenomenal uh, season finale. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. It was I good. very much enjoyed it I the enjoyed entire it, time. But we'll go ahead and, and discuss our, our thoughts on the show as a whole. So, um, I'll start. I'll kick us off. And I said personally, the show sh- started off pretty slow. I, you c- you didn't really get the sense of. I mean, you understand the overarching direction that the show was going. It was going to yeah. follow Kenobi, and kind of his his philosophical state and kind of his adventures in between uh, episodes three, Revenge of the Sith, and episode four, A New Hope. So at this point, he's kind of on Tatooine looking over Luke. And I'm not going to go through all the details, but essentially it's following him. He was him a sad boy. And um, it's bringing in the Inquisitors who are um, tools of the Sith, being Darth Vader and um, Darth Sidious at the time and kind of following the the stories between and I think this is probably the big overarching thing is is Reva and Kenobi are the two main stories that are trying to be portrayed here. Would you guys agree with that? Yeah. Like those are the the two main characters. Yeah, that are I mean pretty much the Kenobi and Vader yeah, story will, yeah, and I, then Yeah, the, like the, at the beginning. Yes. It, but then it's also yeah, Vader. Like those it's Kenobi and Vader, but kind of, and that's, and this is this is getting to my other overarching point is that at first, the, that's what I got for the first episode was like, right. oh, these are the two stories yeah. that are going to be yeah. followed right. and portray, portrayed, and and so <clears throat> in between, like a lot of a few of the episodes, the direction was kind of I thought like especially through the first three episodes, it was kind of getting torn between Kenobi, Reva, the Inquisitors. And Darth Vader. So it was kind of like, it was difficult to follow, especially following Reva's story. Would you guys agree with that? That was kind of like, yeah, that's, really well, that's because her it. story made almost no sense. It made no, yeah, it was, it was a little. But to be fair to me, or from my <laughs> side, like not to be fair, but like from my perspective, I didn't, her story didn't necessarily take away from the show. But it didn't really add, add anything, anything either. That, right. that, that, that's Which my... people acted like they were the maddest people on planet Earth, and this was the worst show ever created because that character existed. And I'm like, yeah. it didn't really take away from the show. It just didn't really bring anything either. <laughs> no. right. And I don't understand how you could get that mad about that. Yeah, I think uh, the, yeah. the big issue in what I saw is that kind of the things that happened within Reva's story didn't really go with their the canonical flow of Legends in terms of like nobody knowing who Anakin was. Right. That or that Anakin was Darth Vader was the big thing. And her knowing is kind of weird. The fact that Anakin and it, 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 eventually you figure out that Reva was a, a youngling and she, the reason why she's trying to become the grand inquisitor is, is, is essentially for vengeance against yeah. what would happen in the Jedi temple. And you know, a lot of those things I, I can see why people were upset. Um, but I don't think it really... And I think it could have definitely worked if there was any sort of character development. Yeah. Yeah, and that's that's the thing. I think the show was a little bit too short. They needed more time. 
They need her more time. character definitely yeah. needed more time, For or sure. at least more of an arc. Yeah, in, something in her time. The and only time she ever developed was the one episode where he found out she was a young lady. Exactly. Yeah. They, 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 they. The rest of the show, she was angry the whole time, yeah. and you never knew why. Yeah, you didn't really get a sense of feel. And sometimes, and then after she arced, she was just going back to be angry again. Right. Yeah. And there was no there. Yeah, there was real no building up to the climax. The climax of her character arc kind of just happened, and that's when everything previously made sense. Like you know, it's like okay, now I understand what's going on, the justification between her actions, why she's doing what, you know, so on and so forth. Right. So that was a little jank. Um, but to be fair, I don't think that necessarily took away from the high points of the show. It just didn't, no. it, it didn't give the audience a great sense of direction. And the high points of the show were stupid high. Oh, they were so good and portrayed, uh, I think they portrayed Vader. I think they did a better job of portraying Vader's character than they did Kenobi's. Like, I'm not saying that it was bad. I just think... Right. Since, also, since we didn't really get a sense... We haven't got really anything in terms of mainstream media that has break, broken down, really, Vader's rise in mental philosophy quite like we did in this show. You know, you kind of already had a good sense of Kenobi's uh, morals and stances. and Because you know the mm. end point where he was going to become... But I think in this one, we actually see the conflict between Vader yeah. a lot yeah. better um, between Anakin and and Darth Vader himself. Yeah. If maybe. that makes sense. No, it does. So, so anyways, we're kind of getting a little lost in thought there. Ooh. But starting with episode one, it was good. It was a good intro. Uh, there were flashbacks of um, Order 66, which were, you know, terrifying yeah they were <laughs> and, chilling and chilling you know and just to see uh, just the devastation behind essentially that heinous act so that was good um you got to enter you got ben um being kenobi introduction to him and kind of seeing how how far he has fallen from what you've seen yeah. in um the original uh Prequels. He was a sad boy. Yes. In hiding. For sure. And just kind of have, he's lost faith. He's cut himself off from the force and is kind of in this deep and depressing, you know, just complete shatter. He's just, a, he's just a shadow of his former self. Yeah. I mean, he literally doesn't, I mean, not only does he like obviously not really know if he believes anything about the Jedi anymore. But he also doesn't see himself as a Jedi anymore, and he definitely doesn't see himself as a good person, person anymore. Exactly, because he's so like he, he is shattered. He's he's put it's essentially everything that happened from Revenge of the Sith up until this yeah. point on his sol- so shoulders because of how he messed up with Anakin. Yeah. So. So yeah, you got to you get to see that, um, but then eventually, you know, at he still has somewhat of a purpose and drive and that being protecting Luke at right. this point. But you can tell that he's still he's still shattered by the way he goes about it. Yeah. And he kind of has this he's not bold at all. He's not bold. He just seems like he's going through the motions. He knows he has to do it, but he doesn't really see the purpose behind do- like he sees the purpose behind doing it, but he's just going through the motions, right? Yeah, he's still doing yeah. it like very scared. Scared. Like, like because, then- you know, like, I mean, it's just like they said in the episode one where, like, the Jedi, like, can't help themselves or whatever. Like, you know, with being good and everything. Yeah. And, like, Obi-Wan it seems, is, is, like, fine just not doing, doing good it. anymore. Yeah. And, like, you know, obviously obviously by how it ended, Obi-Wan has no worries about anybody finding him because he can hold his own yeah. with anybody. <laughs> so, so yeah. So, to keep things a little bit short, because we're getting a little winded here but essentially so it goes from that to him ha- at least finding a resemblance of purpose so but so bail organa so essentially it goes to leia and i think the actor they picked for leia 
She did a phenomenal job. Yeah, I think, I think it was great. She yeah. got Carrie Fisher's personality in yeah. miniature form. She had her down. mannerisms and everything. It just it just seemed like a, a young Leia. So I think yeah. that was really good um, casting on, and on the their part. the dynamic yeah. between young Leia and Obi-Wan was phenomenal. Yeah. And it also made everything make a lot more sense for the original trilogy. For how she knew Obi-Wan... And yeah, it, 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 it definitely, it definitely and, it, yeah. it tied things together um, really well, which was kind of a question at first because people, and that's where a lot of the, the, the faults, at least I think we have, lie is, like we said, the, sh- the direction that you, can, you didn't really know exactly how they were going to push this to the next level yeah. after the first, like, because you thought mm-hmm. some of this would be explained through the first, like, three or four episodes. Right. And they didn't really do that until, I guess, till episode four, right? That I, was. I legitimately saw somebody on Twitter that said, I can't believe that this series is about Leia meeting Obi-Wan. Like, and they said, in A New Hope, like, she didn't even know who Obi-Wan was. And I was like, she sent a transmission to Tatooine. <laughs> On a droid that had his name mentioned multiple times. <laughs> Help me, Obi Wan. You're our oh, only hope. Yeah, like, yeah, she okay. doesn't know him though. Yeah, yeah. 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 And she definitely <laughs> doesn't know where he is. Yeah. <laughs> Just sort of straight to Tatooine, I mean, where he was. Yeah, no, didn't know. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So, like the first few episodes, and, and yeah, are basically Obi Wan. Going, and she called him Obi Wan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. not yeah. Ben. Also, that, that's not Obi-Wan. Ben. Ben. Because, yeah. because they know now, or you can see that it's an understanding that nobody calls him Obi Wan unless it is dead serious. Yeah, if it is dead serious, you call him Obi Wan because you're like, I need the Obi Wan. That's because there's not too many people alive that know who Obi Wan who is. Yeah. Yeah. So the people that are alive that know him are serious dudes. Yeah, yeah. and so and do So yeah, so like just the. F- like, I think that honestly added so much more for me for A New Hope, that the fact she has, you know, the boldness to say Obi-Wan, like, he must have saw that and been like, oh, oh my goodness, <laughs> like, this is getting bad. Like, oh, and, she definitely needs the help y- of the old man, yeah, just like I sure. told her. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You ever and need I think, help too, from like, towards the end of the series, you see how Obi-Wan develops and finally gets more attuned to the force or at least he lets it pack happy boy um uh, into him he, he finally like finds when, he's it's reinvigorated like when you turn on a light in exactly. a dark room exactly that's a good quote that was that, that was, 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 that was yeah. a cool moment yeah that was a, such a when they described the when obi-wan described the force to leia like yeah. that that was one of the cooler moments in that show I yeah because that's such a it's it's so poetic and encompassing what the force yeah, actually, it, 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 like at least um, we obviously I mean, almost, don't know, but what it's been described throughout, yeah. you know, George Lucas and through his new creation of the Star Wars universe. But but seeing him gradually embrace the light and becoming the Obi Wan that we all know and love when was, that man was hit really the cool. Obi Wan signature. Pose as he yeah, turned they, on the lightsaber again, yeah. and I'm they like, "Oh, of, he's all the way back." They, they quoted a lot, of, a lot of the the fight between him and Anakin on Mustafar. I will do what right. I must. And then the hello there, the hello there was incredible, and yeah. everything that I wanted. This was in, more. The, in the last episode too. I, I knew it was well. I mean, obviously everybody knew, but whenever he threw the rocks out, like because he was covered, right? Yeah, and he threw them out, and just by his jump, it was he's a like, force jump. Back. It was like he's not holding back. Like he even used the force just to jump. Because he, yeah, he's <laughs> like he he's, finally he's on a mission now. Because during that moment, he went back back and reflected on. It seemed like the it, it's you saw the fight of Anakin, yeah, and Obi Wan on Mustafar. I guess technically Darth Vader at that point, but you know. Anyways, and then you saw like, oh, you know, I failed him. And you can see like at first he's still having those doubts, but then he remembers Leia, Luke. Yeah, the people you know yeah. that he's trying to to save, and that's when he finally embraces the light side of the force, and that's pretty cool. And then that's when he regains his ability, and yeah, an awesome fight ensues. But before we go, because there's a really important, there's some really cool parts in that fight. But anyways, like the first two or three episodes are him saving Leia, losing Leia, and then saving Leia again. So that was yeah. kind of. Uh, it seemed like uh, there was some character development. There was some. 
there were some good things from those shows, but it just seemed kind of recycled in a sense where like that was happening back mm-hmm. and forth. There were still great moments. There were still important um, character progression, but that was just a little, a little weird. But then episode four came, and that's when we start to see Vader at his peak yeah. evilness. <laughs> like it was crazy what he was doing, just to bait Obi Wan out, and you know, and well, he was... didn't care about anything else. No, and yeah. he was going to do whatever it took to get him. Yeah, yeah. And so he was doing some heinous things to some innocent civilians on, what was the planet they were on? Do you want to remember? I can't remember. It was a uh, Jedi yeah. route or whatever. What the path? It, it was, was the path. Jabeam. 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 Yep. That's right. It was a path. I say it was one of the stations for the path for the Jedi that they yeah. had. But that was like the first glance. Like we knew Darth Vader was powerful, but at this point we're like, oh crud, this dude bad. Yeah, like, he's not yeah. just powerful. He is he's, also very evil. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> and so I mean, and then he will do whatever it takes to get to Obi Wan. So of course, you know, there's kind of like the uh, there was kind of like the sim- the symb- symbolism between um, Vader, like you know, because Vader ends up burning, yeah, Obi Wan, so on and so forth, and Obi Wan escapes, and then what was after that? That was Episode. So, I well, mean, Leia those was, they escaped, and then... Leia got kidnapped. Or, well, not well, the kidnapped. Where are we at? No, are Leia we, got uh, moved to the... Are we on Jabim or not? No, we're after Jabim. After Jabim. Okay. He goes to save Leia, he, right? From the from thing? From the, the, uh, inqu- the, the palace, the Inquisitorious, Palace Inquisitor, or whatever it's called. Okay, I thought we were... Oh, no, we're past <laughs> that. Yeah. I'm backwards. Yeah. Oh, are we backwards? Because whenever we were talking about Darth Vader being like ruthless and everything, we were yeah. talking about him being on Jabim. Which is in the path, and he already has Leia with him. Yeah. With yeah. Tala. So, folks, we're sorry, our recap skills are not the best. Yeah, I got yeah. backwards. So they get away, and then... But Work in the, progress. The yeah. The hyperspace engines don't work, yeah. and that transitions into episode six. Yeah. Which in we, which they're... They're, that's what I say, that's when they're so, chasing him behind and he gets the drop ship to go. Oh, Jeff, our timer. But well, our TV. Gosh dang but, okay, it. So, but yeah, yeah, so he we hits do the a drop. Recap, but. He hits that drop ship and that's when Obi-Wan, or not Obi-Wan, that's when Darth Vader is like, you can tell that he cares about nothing else. Yeah. It's because he leaves the entire transport full of people of the path. That are probably very um, that are you know substantial to the you know the rise of the rebellion. Yeah, and he leaves all of them to chase Kenobi by himself instead. And that fight was, yeah, phenomenal. It was incredible. It was like a top two or three lightsaber fight in the entire series. It begins, and I already told Brian this, but I haven't told Nate this, and I haven't told everybody else this. But it really begins to make me think because you know the sequels. Everybody was really upset because they're like. What the heck you would have thought with the new technology because the prequels had so many cool lightsaber battles, like that the sequels would have cool lightsaber battles too. Like this is ridiculous. Right. But I'm starting to think, or maybe realize, I just think that it's Ewan McGregor and Hayden Christensen. They go hard. They, have it's, you seen the routines? Yeah, it's unreal. They're so good. They are like, crazy. They have fully committed to being that good yeah. Yeah. at it. And it's not a choreography thing. It's an actor thing. Yeah. When when Obi Wan like destroys the what is it the left side of Vader's mask? Yeah. And you can hear Hayden's yeah. voice and Darth Vader's. Yeah. And it's going back between Hayden it's, and James yeah. Earl Jones. James Earl Jones yeah. and Aiden Christensen's voice. That was, that was crazy. Was crazy. So they were like interjected like sometimes you could hear them both at the same time and you could yeah. still you hear could like the slight bit of hope that anakin was still in there for, i saw, like just I, a second i saw a picture and it zooms in really close on their face and you can see a tear yeah, yeah. and you can when, see that i, I didn't, I, didn't I like the symbolism that. too of so it's where he said what he say he said he said i'm not your i'm failure, not your failure Obi-Wan. Obi-Wan. I, that, that, and it was in Hayden Christensen's voice and Anakin's voice, most of the line was. And then eventually, you know, he says that you didn't kill Anakin Skywalker. I did. did. But it it fades from the 
Obi Wan's lightsaber, the blue light was reflecting on him, and it fades to a full red. Yep. As he says it, and then it like cuts away and cuts back, and he has the Sith yellow eyes. He didn't so, have the so, Sith yellow yeah, eyes like while at the beginning. He said, "I'm not your failure, Obi Wan." His eyes his are eyes turned back to turned blue. Back, yeah, his eyes turned back to blue, and they turn when he said it, and it cuts back, and they turn back to Sith yellow. And he says that yes. he says that he killed Anakin and Skywalker. You can tell at that moment the reason why Darth Vader was struggling so hard is because there was that internal conflict. Yeah, Anakin between was, Anakin and Darth yeah. and his old master, he was still he's still struggling. And well, with, I mean, it's also because Obi Wan is the only well, at this time is the only one who can bring Anakin back. So it makes sense that Darth Vader wants to kill him. Yeah, at least that's then, what that's what Darth Vader. Yeah, that's that would what, be the last thing. That's what Darth that Vader could thinks. keep Anakin down inside. Yeah, and so he's obsessed with it, and 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 he he's trying to basically quell the only internal, um, like the inter- internal like ph- philosophical constraint that he has to Anakin Skywalker, yeah. and he's trying to finally get because he thinks that killing Obi Wan will get rid of that, and so that yeah. Darth Vader can fully like what like what you're saying. Yep. So yeah, so that's I mean that's cool. You know, if I were to to rate this, I'd probably give it an eight to an eight and a half out of ten. Um, the beginning was uh the only my only quarrels with it being that the beginning was a little the it, I I think the writing could have been a little bit better to uh tell the backstories of a lot of the characters and a little bit better of character development leading up to. For clarity for the audience um, of the path forward, maybe shoot a little bit more of um, of uh, things that happened before, like uh, during Order 66, show kind of like the relationship between Anakin and Obi-Wan, which we already know that really well, but maybe specifically Reva, get her, like, you at least not blatantly tell us why she's wanting revenge, but at least allude to it a little bit. You know, certain things like that could have done uh, wonders for I her character. Like- she may be their game plan for her, and part of why they didn't develop her is that she may get a spinoff. Well, still, you can still, yeah. you can still. I know, but that might be it. That was yeah. what it felt like. Kind of the, the thought process possible, would have but... to be is that they sacrifice the scream time in hopes of maybe just filling it later with a spinoff, which isn't necessarily the right way to operate. But, but it does kind of feel like how I'm not watching it. Yeah, it does <laughs> kind of feel like hey, it's like the one idea Disney's that I heard floated pocket, out was like a no. what if she has a spinoff where she's you know essentially hunting the Inquisitors. Yeah, that'd that, be really cool. But uh, yeah, I don't know. But I don't know if that's very. I don't know if that's the direction they're they're going with. But who knows? Cool. But yeah, no. But yeah, it was, it was, it was real solid. good. I'd say eight and a half is a solid number. The highs were extremely high. The highs yeah. were above ten high, and, and the lows were just mediocre. That's why. So, but they weren't think... necessarily bad. Nope. Yeah. So yeah. All right. Good show. Highly recommend all Star Wars fans and even non Star Wars fans to check it out. But you definitely yeah. need some background in the Star Wars universe before you. The prequels. Specifically, would help, the, and the the prequels. I mean, the originals would also help yeah. because you still get the characters right. either way. Yeah. A good show. Hopefully, we can clean At up different ages, summarizing and recaps in the future because there's still definitely a lot more shows we like to talk about. But like I said, this is a Cover this is a work in progress. So. Miss Marvel. Oh no, I haven't even watched that yet. No, you gotta catch it's up. Pretty good. It's actually not bad. Thought it would be not not bad at all. It's I'll, just a Disney Channel show. I'll, I'll just I'll just it doesn't uh, even feel like that. I got strange. It a little bit more. Me. Does a little bit more than that, but it does feel more like that because they are in high school. So right. Yeah, it I'm, just has some of those antics in it. That's true. And like typical lines, that yeah. kind of stuff. I have too many shows to he, watch. Yeah, gets, you do. <laughs> it's Marvel. So. Nate still hasn't watched Stranger Things. Oh, no. I've never watched any of Stranger yeah, Things. Yeah, but Nate has had one episode of season three that he's been uh, holding on well, to for like dumb. three years. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. All right, Brian. <clears throat> Let's why can't why can't we go to Otter's game? Why, can't, um, why did the well, Otters hate us? Boy, I would like to know the answer to that question. But you do. I know. They emailed you back. No, they didn't. <laughs> so we 
First off, realize that we don't qualify for media credentials because apparently those are a lot of qualifications for those, no matter what level of anything you're at. Not the biggest surprise, but you know. Well, that's true. Not the biggest surprise, but we thought maybe they might be a little bit le- lower <laughs> at a lower <laughs> yeah, level of baseball. <laughs> true. But found yeah, out they're not. Sports. They're still pretty much the same. So we sent an email to their social media director person who's in charge of their sponsorships and stuff and partnerships. And we're like, hey, Ooh. we would love to come and partner with you guys if we could in any capacity. That is where that conversation ended. We have heard nothing. They said yes. They did not say <laughs> yes. So we're just going to show up yep. and act <laughs> like they said yes. Uh, yeah, I, I'm here for the media pass. Uh, we're covering the game, the game today. Yep. Yeah, we're I'm sure we can get away with it. Yeah, so we act like we know what we're talking about. We have heard nothing. So as of now, that's where that's at. Nice. So North Davies basketball Keep games. You uh, <laughs> so if you know. Anyone from North Davies wants to have us out for a basketball game, we'd come watch it and put it on our YouTube. And be like, yeah, I don't know. I give the game a 7 out of 10. It was a little slow. Yeah. <laughs> 7 out of 10. But we won, so a 10 out of 10. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Southern Indiana basketball, it's a lot, of, a lot of passing and spread offense. True. So, you know, 24 to 23 is we not We should the have most time exciting. to talk. That's true. Oh, yeah. well, definitely. We yeah. should interview People, People during the game, during the yeah, like the Mike players, Dally, just Mike Dally, Mike, Dally, Mike, Dally. Mike Yeah, we could do mic, <laughs> mic up people, or we could just get a big parabolic mic and just be yes, holding it one hundred percent, just from the top. Yeah. Like, How much do those things cost? They got to be an absurd amount of money. I don't know. Surely they're cheap. No way. <laughs> no shot. They're cheap. Let's go see. You guys keep going, but yeah. So you know, if. Anyone from North Davies, our good old-fashioned alma mater, wants to hit us up. We will also probably We can sit right next out. to 106.5. We will figure it out. The bullet. <laughs> Don't they broadcast games? I think so. Yeah. They also have a Facebook stream, too, right? Yeah. Which is... I don't know who does it anymore. I think Ring County Sports... That network. Well, no, I mean, like I thought North Davies had their own that they broadcasted to at one time. That's Maybe possibility. Not. How we much could, is it? We could get one. 10K? For 300 bucks. 300 bucks? There's no shot. Yeah, it's right Does here. it work? From 30 to 50 feet. Oh my God. That might be enough. <laughs> <laughs> That's almost enough. But yeah, maybe we could do something like that. We'll see. I think it would be Get fun. Get a parabolic mic. <laughs> no. <laughs> but our goal is still to do game a game of some sort in some capacity, whether it be basketball or baseball or football. Hey, why don't we just contact the Pacers? You're right. Shoot we might high. as well just shoot. You know what they say, bang. if you shoot for the stars. <laughs> you might just. Wait. If you shoot, shoot at a star or something. shoot for the moon, you land amongst the stars. And if you That's shoot for the moon, then you'll land in the end. You were close. I was close. Hey, early bur- early worm gets the worm. <laughs> what? A bird in the bush is worth two in the hand. <laughs> <laughs> nothing like that. But anyway, so that's, that's our talk. update on that, is that we've heard nothing. They didn't answer us. And so hopefully we'll figure out something for a different avenue. And then we'll vlog it. <laughs> Ooh, vlog, vlog it. We're going to have a We're professional also setup. broadcasting. We're doing both. Oh my goodness. Well, then who's going to vlog it? I guess True. Jeff will We'll vlog have... up until the game. And then we broadcast it. And what, then we vlog, we vlog after the, the game. The buggy's driving by? What are you yeah, talking about? Yeah, that's exactly what we vlog. You know, vlog think, about. Nate, people think about from the content. <laughs> people from Bloomington eat that up. Yeah. <laughs> just a horse taking a dump on the side of the street. <laughs> just like, all right, guys, look at this yeah. horse. They're like, oh, you lived with the Amish? I was like, boy, did I? I went to school with them. <laughs> and they're like, what? <laughs> but, but that's impossible. <laughs> Just what the textbook I... said they were all but dead. <laughs> Maybe the archives are incomplete. Wait. I thought they lived in Pennsylvania only. Yeah. It's... Amish Mafia. <laughs> I love the Amish Mafia. Great show. True. 100% but... staged. High quality content. <laughs> anyway. But yeah. yeah. So, there's so next that. week we'll have uh, one of our Amish brethren on the podcast or next guest. <laughs> For real. <laughs> Just going to keep promising guests and one yeah. of them will be here. 
Yeah. Not yeah. Eric. Not Eric. Eric obviously Colby. not Eric. <laughs> Our full time guest, but Yeah. Oh. All right, Jeff. I'm lost. What's our next? Yeah. Well, what Overwatch else did we two. have? Oh, Overwatch 2. Oh, yeah, that's happening. Yeah. You got like four minutes. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Overwatch 2 beta. Overwatch 2 beta. <laughs> yeah, so uh, that's coming up. Tuesday. We, Tuesday. The, which is? Yesterday. 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 We'll see you yesterday. Today. We'll so. see you yesterday <laughs> and also tomorrow. So, Ooh. so yeah. Come and jo- join us. And... We'll be live yesterday. And we'll also be live Thursday, we which live is tomorrow. <laughs> we were live at five o'clock yesterday. Go watch the VOD. That's right. The VOD. Yes. What? Video on demand. We have on demand stuff. How much people have to pay for it's that? It's just our stream that stays up. You don't have to pay <laughs> for no, it at no all. Pay-per-view. It's free. Uh, no, well, make sure to go into the link in the description and pay uh, for it. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that, please. No. Nate. <laughs> There's Please no, do it. No. <laughs> we need the money. <laughs> we're not going to scam people. <laughs> <laughs> and make sure to sign up for an account. <laughs> oh, no. Make sure to sign up for an insub- Instagram pyra- account. Join yeah. our pyramid scheme. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, for if real. we could just get three more people. <laughs> <laughs> if we could get three more people, then we could, we could do it. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you enjoy Junker Queen's big axe. Long story short. Oh yeah, remember. <laughs> Don't forget about the big ideas. Yeah, yeah can't forget about those. <laughs> Subscribe for Junker Queen's big axe. <laughs> oh baby. <No. laughs> All right. So next week, hopefully we can. Hopefully we can have Eric. Potentially. We're gonna try. If not, what, if we're not gonna try. we'll fill the seat with somebody. We'll, we'll fill the seat with somebody. We're gonna try another guest. So we have some is, ideas. What day is July fourth again? Like what day of the week? Monday. It's it's a Monday. No. The third is a Sunday. I thought the third was a Saturday. I thought I was told it was a Sunday. What? I don't have my phone to check. Didn't you say the box thing was on a third and that was Saturday? No, I thought the third was Sunday. Oh, well, you could be right. It was a Sunday. Third is You're, Sunday. Yeah. Okay. So, so the third, is, yeah, and so the fourth is a Monday. Okay. Well, I mean, I'm I can't edit on Monday. Then it's yes, a holiday. It's a holiday. Yeah. Yes, you can. I can't work. You can only <laughs> edit on Monday. Work. <laughs> nothing. Sorry, don't know what to tell you. <laughs> it's my day off, bro. <laughs> yeah, for real. It's, take it up with the government. Yeah, for real. <laughs> True. Well, they so pay take me. it up with Nate. <laughs> I am take the government. <laughs> <laughs> me and Joe are real close. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, who? <laughs> Joe Mama. Mama. <laughs> idiot. Idiot. Walk straight into that one, bro. So, yeah. So, hopefully, we'll have another guest next week. Um, I have a couple ideas of a couple of people. If Eric can be here, then I guess we'll have Eric. I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Been a while. But, yeah. So, like he I said, hasn't even seen Nate, the podcast what? room I yet. Got, I got an idea for the outro. Start, start the chainsaw. We're going to gas ourselves out. Oh, oh no. <laughs> We'll turn on the air conditioning real quick after you get the chainsaw going. Oh my going. goodness. No shot. This is not safe. <laughs> Do it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Make sure to uh, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. <laughs> For um, quality content you like You can donate this. to my fun- <laughs> Brian's funeral <laughs> arrangements in the link in the description below. <laughs> and yeah it's interactive so if you guys have any recommendations let us know what you think of this podcast and what we could potentially do in future podcasts so Woo! with that being said oh, oh baby there's on. no shot this works <laughs> <laughs> dang it it's probably not prime but prime that thing I don't know started Almost. <laughs> <Dang it>. <laughs> <It's> all... <laughs> this would have been so cool. <laughs> Dang it. Jeff played chainsaw <laughs> noises. <laughs> 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 <laughs>